again, the leader of the Outlaw Nation, Frankie G, bringing you another edition of the Outlaw's Den to keep you up on all the happenings in DWF and... Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, when you hear the screams from the rafters, USA, 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 it means one thing, that the Patriot is about to enter this ring right here and knock somebody out. And it all starts when the little Patriot was all so high and he came to Devastation University and he said, I want to be a pro wrestler. If you want to be a star someday and you want to make it all the way to the top, you want to come here to Devastation University. I am the DWF local commissioner, Nick Schwab, along with the Financial Miracle! Loud. That's what I thought you said. You knew it. All right, we got a we got a hell of a show for you today. Tell tell them some of the matches we got today, Lally. Well, let's start with the top, shall we? We have Nick Arcade. Who? Nick Arcade. Is he making his debut? Making his debut. All right, that's always good to see By your talent. I heard he hails from Gateway Twenty Six. He told me he was from GameStop. Well, we'll have to get clarification on that. Yes, we will. Okay, and he's taking on. Tyreno oh, the boy. Empire. Oh, that's not good. I'll tell you what. Nick Arcade better stock up on the power pellets because he's going to need as many as he can get his hands on when he against the pretty boy badass. Representing the Empire, by the way. Neither one of us are big fans of the Empire. It fired me. It fired too. Hey! Hey! <laughs> we made it though. Yes, we did. We're still here. You can't fire one. That's right. And I can fire you because I'm the commissioner, but I won't. Anyway, and don't forget, later on, in the main event, we have... Lovey, tell him. Wow, you're just going to skip to the main event. Like Kali Kiris, he gets excited. <laughs> That's what she said. Oh, you've been hanging around staying too long. I have. Here's the deal. Since you didn't come prepared, I'm going to do this the right way, Nick. What Sometimes way is that? Sometimes in life, you got to do things, and you know what? Oh, is that a, is that a $20 bill? It is. It's a couple $20 bills. Oh, it's for the strip cup later. Oh, okay. But let's do this. Let's do this right. Okay. Okay, we have L.J. Cruz versus Nathan Avery. So fly L.J. Cruz, the Cruiserweight Champion, and Nathan Avery. You know, I know both of these guys, and that's going to be a heck of a contest. Truth is, L.J. finally wants to show up when he doesn't wrestle, Mark. Come on. But he's wrestling Nathan Avery, one of the up-and-coming superstars here in DWF Loco. And I think that Mark Angel should get to face the winner of that match. What do you think? Well, you're the man that calls shit. So, I like it. Hello? He's not answering. <laughs> All right, then we got Owen O'Neill versus Mark Angel. Your boy, the center of attention. And I'm going to be keeping my eye on you and your boys, because if three of a kind get involved, I might just have to dig up two more and get a full house and keep an eye on your boys. Truth is, I am so sick and tired, and so are the people at home, because they call me and they say, how does this little kid keep winning? And tonight it ends. Owen O'Neill, I will cut your hair if I have to, but you're not going home with that belt. Are you making a guarantee? Well, it's not a non-title match, so I can't make a guarantee that we're going to leave with the belt. But I'll tell you this. Owen, you're going home in a body bag. Yeah. Done. 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 I'm going to have control to, your show, buddy. I'm going to have to keep an eye on you. And it's not my show. It's David Adams' show. David what? Adams. David Adams. I'm just filling in. David Adams. I'm looking quite good, my David dad. David Adams. Never here when he always oh, never here. Well, yeah. never here. You know what? You know, I think I'm actually going to replace him. Then we got Ty Reno Again? teaming up with the big bad Ron Star, and they're going to take on Nick Arcade again. And now he's got a team up with Rivera. What's his name? Ben Rivers. Ben Rivers. You, you know what? You can get Donkey Kong, but it probably wouldn't make any difference against the Empire because they're going to find a way to cheat. I mean, when shenanigans. I call shenanigans. All right, then you have your main event, folks. All jokes aside, we've been having fun here. But the main event, promise you, no laughing matter. For the last couple weeks, you've watched as the diamond studs imploded. We don't have Pull Shark Pete here tonight. He's in a tournament in Vegas. But the truth is, these two are finally going to lock it up. Spades, fearless. And I'll tell you what, if I was a betting man, which I am, my money's on the former tag team champion. 
And I'll tell you what, <laughs> that's going to be the match of the night. I guarantee it. So grab your popcorn. Ooh, popcorn. Tell your wife to make some snacks. Or your girlfriend if you're not married. Pay the bills. Stop complaining and enjoy TV. By demand. The Dot Outlaw's com. Den. Dot com.
on from there until the match is over? We want to make this the biggest benefit show. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, when you hear the screams from the rafters, USA, 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 it means one thing, that the Patriot is about to enter this ring right here and knock somebody out. And it all starts when the little Patriot was all so high and he came to Devastation University and he said, I want to be a pro wrestler. If you want to be a star someday and you want to make it all the way to the top, you want to come here to Devastation University. Nathan Avery in the ring against the Cruiserweight Champion, LJ Cruz. This match is for the Cruiserweight Championship. Your referee, Mr. Ken Stryker. Awesome. This should be a good one, folks. LJ Cruz and Nathan Avery, two of the top stars here in Dexter. Side headlock by LJ Cruz. Avery's up. So far, LJ Cruz. Just back up on the screen. Hard drag takeover by Nathan. Oh, Another hard drag takeover by Nathan. Uh, yeah. In this capacity, he's got behind both participants. Yeah.
Arm ringer there by Nathan Abel. Just like again.
once again, the leader of the Outlaw Nation, Frankie G, bringing you another edition of the Outlaw's Den to keep you up on all the happenings in DWF and...
see that's not intentional. Oh, don't get it. All right. You three. No, I'm three. Hey, man, she was going to win. Hey,
Yeah. I'll tell you what, Nick Arcade did not have much fun last time with Tyrena. Let's see how he does this week. Strength there by Nick Arcade. This may not be the smartest for you. I'll tell you what, this is like walking into a lion's cage. Let's get inside near back. Ron Starr the tag is right here. These two rookies are in over their heads with the Empire. I think Nick Arcade just got all his quarters back on that one.
There's something going on here with the power. What's going on here? here on the Outlaws Den. We thank you for watching, and don't forget, April 2012, DWF is going to be part of a fantastic benefit show with proceeds going to the Children's Hospital in Philadelphia. We need sponsors, as Rapway would say, we need sponsors! I got your back, Rapway, I told you I would say. 267-978-7328, contact Loco GM Jose Rivera Jr. for more details if you can help us out. We want to make this the biggest benefit show. In Gentlemen, boys and girls, when you hear the screams from the rafters, USA, 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 it means one thing, that the Patriot is about to enter this ring right here and knock somebody out. And it all starts when the little place was all so high and he came to Devastation University and he said, I want to be a pro wrestler. If you want to be a star someday and you want to make it all the way to the top, you want to come here to Devastation University. Introducing first. Introducing first. He is Johnny! Ken checking Johnny Ferris for four objects. These guys are former tag team that used to be managed by somebody, but I know nothing about that. Um, anyway, now these guys are bitter enemies. Former tag team partners, former tag team champions, now bitter enemies. Let's get the bell ringing now. Ring that bell! I'll fire you on the spot. Go on, Joe, you've been waiting for this! Get him! He's autographing a shirt. Hello, Dre. I can't send him writing. What is this rough spot? It's a Merry Christmas. Christmas. <laughs>
times you're going around. And I got a feeling that if Johnny Fearless does that one more time, he's going to get caught. Stop! 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 Big European up the by Johnny Fearless. Stop! Pick it up 
Dr. Slim. Scoop! Oh! Have the BS face! Oh! 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 Oh!
once again, the leader of the Outlaw Nation, Frankie G, bringing you another edition of the Outlaws Den to keep you up on all the happenings in DWF and...